Now, to me, they're pretty simple, but like with anything else, there are complications. No sex outside of committed relationships. To me, I wonder what is sex. I have decided it's sexual intercourse. I am not willing to accept the risk of pregnancy or HIV. Thus, I want to wait for intercourse for marriage. I don't want to be approved and I don't want to have unnecessary restrictions. So I don't want to say, I don't want to do this or that. The drug question is something I focused on. I grew up in an alcoholic environment, so I saw the evils of drugs firsthand. But what drugs? All drugs? No recreational drugs, I believe. And this to me includes caffeine. Medicinal drugs are different. I believe the best approach is to take them only when absolutely necessary. I'm in Africa now, but I went to a malaria area, so I decided to take the malaria tablets. It was not a decision I took lightly. It was one that I decided to do very cautiously, but I decided it was the best, and I didn't want to hold on to anything unnecessary. One of my other convictions is veganism. I've been a vegan for almost 11 years, and I'm really glad I did. Now, there has been some concern. Some people say it's too much, too much to do. I believe it can certainly be that way. Some even say, if you go for it, you're going for control issues. And it can certainly be used incorrectly. People like Vegan Outreach and Joanne Stepanek have wise approaches saying you shouldn't worry about insignificant things and also you shouldn't get to the point where you are so obsessed about purity that you are creating anguish in yourself and others. So along the way, I've gotten rid of unnecessary things. And one of the most recent issues has been the issue of certainty. I have this Venn diagram. There are animal products and plant products.